Magandang araw sa inyo mga kaguro. Ngayong araw ay may bago tayong update at tungkol ito sa implementation of 6-hour workday for teachers. Para malaman ang buong detalye, please watch this. The Teachers Dignity Coalition TDC reminded the Department of Education, DepEd, the writer added the policy on working hours with uniformity as it received reports from the field that some teachers are required to render teaching tasks for more than six hours or stay and work in the school beyond eight hours. The group said that these schools violate the existing policies of the DepEd and call on the DepEd management to act swiftly and order the field officials to abide by the rules set forth by the Magna Carta for public school teachers, CSC resolutions and several DepEd issuances. Nasa fourth week pa lang tayo mula nung nagbukas ang klase pero sobrang pagod na ang nararamdaman ng mga guru. Hindi na magkanda ugaga sa napakaraming paperwork, reports at online tasks maliban pa sa face-to-face -face classes, said Benjo Basas, the group's national chairperson. Basas revealed that many teachers have reported excessive workload and longer hours of teaching worse than the pre-pandemic situation. Malinaw naman ang pulisya ng DepEd alinsunod sa resolusyon ng CSC sa pagpapatupad ng Magna Carta, hindi dapat lalampas ng anim na oras ang turo ng bawat guru at ang dalawang oras na laan sa paghahanda sa klase at iba pang gawain ay maaaring iuwi o dalhin kahit saan. Pero bakit? Inaabot ng siyam na oras ang mga guru sa paaralan? Gayong dapat ay makauwi na sila matapos ang anim na oras lamang. Basas explained, As early as 2008, the CSC Resolution 080096 has ordered the DepEd to release guidelines on the six-hour workday or the requirement to stay in their school for only six hours, the two hours intended to accomplish other tasks incidental to normal teaching duties may be brought home or anywhere convenient to them. However, the succeeding DepEd leadership failed to implement the resolution despite the two subsequent issuances from Secretary Jesse Lapas in 2008 and 2009. DepEd Memorandum 281 and Did Order 16, respectively. Until now, many teachers are forced to stay in their respective schools for eight hours or more, even without classes or official functions. This issue has been a perennial problem in most schools and has always been the main cause of conflicts in schools between teachers and administrators. Based on the existing rules, teachers should be entitled to additional compensation once they are compelled to render tasks beyond their normal duties, but it seems that the violations are the new norms. The policy should be uniform and applicable to all schools and not just in Metro Manila, Central Luzon and Calabarzon or in areas where teachers are brave enough to engage the school management. Basas added, According to reports, the primary reason for these violations is the shortage of teaching personnel, thus, the school would either resort to higher class sizes that lead to congestion or longer work hours for teachers. Ito na nga ang problema, pinagmadali ang mga guru na bumalik sa eskwela, ni hindi na halos binigyan ng bakasyon tapos isasabak pa sa trabahong wala na halos pahinga. Lagi na lang bang isasakripisyo ang mga guru? Kung may shortage ng teachers, ang dapat gawin ay mag-hire ng mga bagong teachers batay sa pangangailangan sa field at huwag doblihin ang trabaho ng mga guru para makatipid, Basas explained. The TDC is expecting a clear-cut policy from the Office of Secretary and Vice President Sara Duterte to clarify the implementation of working hours. Umaasa kami na ito ay mapag-uusapan ng DepEd Management at ng mga guru. 
Sana sa pagkakatang ito ay maipatupad na sa buong bansa bilang pagkilala rin naman sa kapakanan ng mga guru lalo ngayong nagdiriwang tayo ng National Teachers Month, Basas ended. Basas said, his group is willing to hold a dialogue with DepEd for this specific matter. Yun lamang ang ating update ngayong araw. Please don't forget to like. Share and subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow our Facebook page, BFAM Salamat.